The Cook Peg J1224 kit features the Cook Peg J12 French tube. This polyurethane tube can only be used with the Cook Peg 24. The GJ tube is advanced into the jejunum over a wire guide through the Peg 24 feeding tube. The GJ adapter is clearly marked and color coded for decompression, medications, and feeding. A unique tapered tip and radiopaque stripe simplifies tube placement. The GJ tube features an open flow tip which allows excellent formula flow into the jejunum. An air plug is secured over the PEG-24 to minimize air leakage during placement. After introducing the gastroscope, insufflate the stomach and examine the stomach and examine the mucosa. The PEG-24 should be placed in the antrum toward the pylorus to ease insertion of the gastrojejunal feeding tube. Remove the feeding adapter and the bolster retainer or pull tie from the previously placed PEG-24 gastrostomy tube. Place biopsy or alligator forceps through the gastroscope and push forceps through the G-tube from the stomach until seen exiting the G-tube. Place the air plug over the wire guide and grasp the end of the wire guide with the forceps. Pull the wire guide and forceps back into the tube and place the air plug securely in the end of the G-tube to minimize air leakage. Once the air plug is secure, use the gastroscope to insufflate the stomach. This will provide better visualization of the antrum and pylorus. Advance the gastroscope with wire guide and forceps through the pylorus and into the second portion of the duodenum. Straighten the wire guide by holding it tightly at both ends. Advance the wire guide and forceps to the third portion of the duodenum. Remove the air plug from the G-tube. Place the gastrojejunal tube over the wire guide. Generously lubricate the GJ tube with water-soluble lubricant, especially at the tip. Slowly advance the GJ tube over the wire guide while maintaining slight tension on the wire guide. Continue advancement of the tube until it dislodges the forceps from the wire. Remove the forceps from the scope and plug the GJ feeding adapter firmly into the G-tube. Visualize the GJ tube with a gastroscope to verify tube position. Carefully remove the wire guide while observing endoscopically. Again, verify that the GJ tube has not fallen back into the stomach and remove the gastroscope. Secure bolster retainer or pull tie around the bolster collar, being careful not to crimp it. This concludes the Cook Peg 24 feeding system.